We've seen some amazing uh, performances here tonight. I feel really humbled to be given the opportunity to speak at this really quite moving event. Uh, we're surrounded by the swirling snow and the icy winds, but here in this theater, we're celebrating the vibrancy of our, di our diverse languages and cultures. It's a wonderful, wonderful experience, and I know that you feel the same way that I do about that. So I'm grateful to each of you for taking time at this really crowded and busy time of year to bring your language and your culture to be present, to be heard, to be recognized, to be celebrated this evening. So why are we here? Why are we in this room? Well, of course there's a reason. It's the role of the university to nurture and uphold the languages. And it's the role of the students' associations to really stand for these identities, these heritages that matter so much to all of us. So well done, student organizations. Well done. Your languages strengthen us all. And I think it is profoundly right that it's the Bangladeshi Students Federation that has gathered us together tonight to celebrate International Mother Language Day. <laughs> Grounds for Nation. That's our generational heritage. That is the heritage that our languages provide for us. So, language diversity, is it worth our time? Is it worth our energy? Is it worth our commitment? I want to share with you a little bit of a very old language that was nearly lost. It's a, a short passage which has to do with the most beautiful garden, the most beautiful time of year. And it's a garden that is so beautiful that no one language could possibly express, could possibly describe all the beautiful things that are in it. So this is from 500 years ago, and it's from the north of Scotland. Describe a world that who could well indite, how all the fields with the lilies white de paint were bricht, whilk to the heaven did gleet. Not thou, Omer, as fair as thou could write, for all thy ornate style so parfait. Nor yet thou, Tullius, whose lips sweet of rhetoric did into termes fleet, your aureate tongues both been all to lead, for to compile that paradise complete. We have paradise complete here tonight. Thank you very much.